Hey, 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 everybody. What's going on? Welcome to my channel, T-Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my ch ch gemini My Gemini. What's going on, Gemini High Five Cross Watchers? Welcome. Thank you for all your love, your subscribes, your, your comments, your donations, books, readings, everything. Sending you a lot of love and hugs to everybody. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Keep in mind it's a general message. It will not resonate with everybody, nobody. Only take what fits for you and leave the rest. Choir, come to the front. Ahem. <clears throat> One, two, three, oh, T-Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective, T-Girl, 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 Magic and Collective, T-Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective, check us out and see what we're about, ooh, we are Gemini, 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 we sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Thank you. Yay, choir. You guys are the bomb.com. Holy Spirit, ancestors, ascended masters, what's going on in Gemini? Somebody stuck in the hangman mode. Somebody's trying to, I don't know, figure it out, get some type of epiphany, but they're stuck a little bit. Somebody from your past, okay? They can't get out of their, they can't seem to get the past out of their head. Yep, they can't stop thinking about the, a new beginning or they could have had a new beginning. There's some of them, they can't stop thinking about sex with you. They're all in their head about it, this King of Cups energy. He is torn. Because the Empress in my deck, this deck right here, I was going to repair it and, you know, Put a little tape here, but he's torn, okay? His foundation, he's weak, he's he's torn. Like, because I'm saying this torn at the knee area, which leads me to know, like, this foundation is kind of torn right now. He has a lot of love and emotions for you or her, okay? You make this person very, very, very happy. Something's been illuminated to this person about what they possibly previously invested in or they've been. In, it's been illuminated that they should have invested with you they should have moved forward with you but instead they ghosted you so they're stuck right now okay why are they stuck spirit because yeah we know they should have invested in you what what got them in they could be facing jail time too they could have legal problems and battles and stuff like that but um yeah so there they got possibly uh, got into a fight and went to jail for some of them okay they're fighting they're claiming it's self-defense whatever we're getting off track but anyway tell me why is the spirit i mean why is this energy stuck spirit on gemini the past why can't they get the past out of their head why can't they get their secrets oh because they were not being honest when they left you and closed out a cycle or when this cycle closed out they were traveling to other lovers in secret possibly somebody to their past that got them entrapped now, I don't know why they could be in jail or just mentally. I'm just getting a lot of mental entrapment. They're still holding on to you. And wherever they went, they're fussing and fighting. And there's a lot of conflict and chaos to wherever they're going. So, okay. Tell us more, spirit. Please, please. Thank you. What else is happening with this energy, spirit? How is, um... What is the secret? Okay, this is the secret. They were secretly traveling, too. To the lovers. They were secretly traveling to other... They, so they were cheating on you pretty much. Okay? Acting single. Partying up. Living it up. Okay? Giving sex in everybody. Sex in these third-party energies. Whoever they were cheating on you with. Okay? Possibly a baby mama or family situation. It could be somebody in their family that they was cheating on you with. I heard cousin. Oh, wow. I Okay, Spirit, let's keep on moving because you already know. <laughs> Ah, and they said, tell them, I said, auntie. So some of them were, oh God. Okay. So for some of them, they was, um, it, it could have been, a, they was cheating on you with an auntie. Okay. And a cousin or a cousin, possibly a family, something with a family. They was having child. What in the hell is this spirit? Oh my God, don't say they were lovers with their family members, child. Jesus Christ. 
I mean, I can't, I mean, I can't say that that's not possible at all because that's very possible. I I mean, honestly, there's a, this, oh, wow. I, anyway, Spirit, what's going on? Because mi millions of people all worldwide are having incest or sex with their family members. So, I mean, even though it's abnormal and stuff like that, people do that. Um, for me, I'm not going to say no judgment, my God, because that period of life is over. I think they might validate it because of the land of Adam and Eve, the time of Adam and Eve, because, you know, Seth um, and, 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 and Cain and Abel, they had, you know, then they had daughters too, uh, Adam and Eve. And so how they you know, procreated the earth. There was incest at that time. However, that time is no more, okay? We are in a new age and dispensation. God has ages and dispensation. What's good for one time is not good for another time. Like also like baptizing, we get spiritually baptized. I mean, I'm going to be stepping on a lot of toes, but it is what it is. And God says, speak the truth and let the chips fall where they may. So anyway, there's this time. I'm just going to say timetable. Time is for... There's a time, uh, you know that song by the Beatles? A time for something, a um, turn, turn. A time for this, a time for that. There's a time for everything. At that time, for God to populate the, populate the earth, because there was only two individuals at that time, they had to have come together and have offspring. Well, how were they going to multiply? Well, they were going to come together and keep it in the bloodline. That's why a lot of royals feel like incest is okay, because they keep that in the bloodline, because that was how they did it from the way back day, but not understanding how God has ages and dispensations and that cycle and chapter of incest has been closed now, okay? So there's no need to be sleeping with family members anymore to procreate the earth. The earth is already overpopulated and I don't know why we're having this conversation because somebody needs to understand that that time is not okay. I don't know if somebody told you or a family member told you that that's okay and that's how they did it and we keep it in like, no, okay, mm-mm. So whoever this energy is, is in regret that they invested, or probably was sleeping with their damn mama. Oh, whoop. I was going to pray for this individual. I don't know. What else, spirit? They, Jesus, out now. So this, I should have said, I didn't know it was going to be triggering, okay? So this is going to be a trigger to somebody. So get out right now, because I don't, I don't know what else is going to come out, okay? This may not be the reader for you. I may not be the reader for you, because, honey, um, most of my readings are triggers, <laughs> okay? This person, yeah, they're feeling some kind of way because they laid to rest their ace of pentacles. You could have had a family member. Spirit said that's the truth. They laid there to rest, preventing this person from making an offer towards you. The Empress energy, okay? Um, and 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 they it would have been victor victorious and successful. So this person does feel some kind of way because they listened to people from their past or family members from their past. And they were, that's why they held back from making a solid offer for, from you, okay? Um, due to uh, religious beliefs, uh, you know, how they think you guys were just too different. In that sense, you, you, don't, you don't think those what, that way. They have that old way of thinking and um, yeah. So anything else, Holy Spirit, what is going on? I didn't know we were going to do all this. What else, Spirit? So now they're spying on you. This person is spying on you to see if you're single and if you're working with anybody else and they're worried about who you're having sex with. See, this is a, a very, number one is a dysfunctional family, number one, or a person coming from a dysfunctional family, okay? Um, and they're worried about who you're having sex with. So this is a sexually dysfunctional family that's under judgment right now. And so the, or this person is under judgment for being with their family, okay, in that in that sense, okay, and they're all their family is doing is right now is fussing and fighting, possibly over the empress that we just saw. Yeah, from the toxic ways and behaviors, this whatever this low vibrational activity is that they're doing. Yeah, you see how they're chained together, so they are sleeping with their family, somebody in their family. Unbeknownst to you, it could be a cousin, a sister, it could be a brother, shit. I mean, if it's a male, he could be sleeping with his own brother. Um, That's not uncommon, I don't think. And I mean, it's not as far as like, don't make it seem like the men 
it's always, you know, I mean, the women, are, however, it can be same-sex cousins, okay, you guys? That's what I'm getting. Yes, from their family, okay? Some of their, their child, oh, my God. So, why does you not need to know any of this energy? Why do they need to know? Why do they need to know? Why? Because they do feel some kind of way, though. They feel, they're in their feelings about you, and they want to come. Because what I'm telling you is the truth. They want to come in and say, and make an offer towards you. Queen of Cups energy, this immature person. So they possibly have been doing this since they were a child. This disgusting family member has been violating this child. I mean, well, they do. They're still in child energy, even if they're a grown person. See, those types of acts, that stunts growth for a, a, a young person, okay? You, 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 you kill off that young person and leave them wherever they're at. Am I a doctor? No, I'm, this is my own opinion, okay? This is why a lot of older people, they don't heal from childhood trauma, they still operate in that whatever state that they were left in of that date, that age that they were in that trauma. But they want to come to you now and heal certain things with you. Okay, this person is, they do have a delayed response. Okay, they're slow. They move slow. Yeah, and they want to come to calmer waters with you or it's taking them a long time to come to calmer waters with you to give this solid offer and balance things out. It could be a Libra that they want to come to or you want to come to to heal things. They could have Aquarius in their chart somewhere. They could be on a public platform speaking the truth, very guarded and defensive against whoever this energy is um, having nostalgic memories and feelings about them. The stuck energy, the, stu the stuck energy Wants to do, uh, wants to bring a Knight of Cups to you, Gemini High Vibe, because they're feeling like the wounded warrior. They're confused, okay, in their mind. Yeah, because they were manipulated, okay, at a youth. Mm, this is sad. This is so sad. Oh, well, I mean, what, what advice, Spirit? I don't even know what to say. Like, because this is not, I don't feel that this is high vibrational. Now, you you are you are a healing energy to this person. You are very loving and nurturing and kind. But this is above your degree, so to speak. Now, if you are a you know, psychologist, a doctor in that sense, then, I mean, you make your own decision. You already know the truth of what you need to do. But for those that are, do not have that type of degree or training, this is above your spiritual pay grade. You need to let it go to God at the end of the day. They need to go within and have some type of spiritual awakening. What else, spirit? Yeah, because whatever they've gone through, they're too toxic. Like, I don't know how dark this goes. It is a mother figure. Oh, my God. Mm, mm, mm. What else, spirit? So this person, yeah, they have a warped sense of how family, may, how to be. They have a warped sense of love. That's why they're over-sexual right now, sleeping with everybody and everything because they think that that's how they express love is through sex because their mom was expressing or their auntie, parental figure was expressing that through sex. Okay, this type of energy. And they got pleasure from it too. So it kind of confused this energy, okay? Yeah, so they thought possibly maybe that's what they were supposed to do. You know, it made them happy when they did it or whatever the case may be, even though it confused them at the same time. Like this is something, this is what I'm saying. This person, they didn't know what to think or how to feel. All they know is it felt good to them as a child. Okay, they didn't know why. And this brought down the tower to this person's life low key. That's why they were always caught up in third party situations or thought third party situations was cool. That's how they expressed their love in third party situations. And now this person's very angry. So, you know what? When you do that to a child and take away their childhood and who they really are in that moment, they become angry. This is why we have a lot of angry adults out w walking around in this earth plane because they were manipulated. They were lied to. They were backstabbed and betrayed. And you got these angels feeling a little defeated right now. Okay? So, this energy, and I'm not trying to put, put like, make it, like, it is sad what happened to this person, but this person, like I said, they need to go within and heal because they're not the first ones and whoever this is, is not the first ones to go through this, you know, and I'm not saying it's right, but everybody goes through things differently and heals differently. And so just the way this person, I mean, they just, it was, they're just in a low vibration right now. Yeah. And they want to come to you and they're stuck. They're feeling they're crying over spilled milk that they walked away from their two of cups to have these third-party situations with their some of their family. 
Yeah, but now they want to work on this with you because they realize that they feel like the only way they'll be happy again is if they come back together with you. And you can help balance them out right now because you are their Ten of Cups, okay? You are the Ten of Pentacles. You are their Four of Wands. Yeah. And they feel the spiritual connection, okay? So they feel that the spiritual connection will heal them. So what is the obstacle, Holy Spirit? Maybe that's what I need. What is the obstacle of this individual, you know, moving? What is the obstacle? They're, they need they need counseling. They need to work. They are a sex addict. That's what I'm getting. And they get bored extremely easy wherever they're at. So they're very non-committal, very flighty. Okay, with the king. I mean, the the the. I don't know who king it is, but it's the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Swords. Very non-committal and flighty. Okay, they could be an older gentleman, a father figure. You know, who's all stressed out, anxiety and things like that. Yeah. Hmm. So, yeah, there's nothing that you can really do. So, they're just like, why is Gemini knowing that this person, because they want to travel towards you. They want to travel towards you. What are you, what are you thinking, spirit? What are you thinking? They want to travel towards Gemini for a so-called equal give and take. But spirit said they're going to only, they're not going to do nothing but slow you down and they don't really have anything to offer you. This person is very arrogant, likes to be seen by other people. They like, yeah, they're all in their head because they're a sex addict. They don't know how to get out of this energy. They don't know how, well, how should this person get out of this energy? I just told you, pray, you need to go to God. You need to have some type of his spiritual healing. You got to go within. You can't look for it without. Go within and listen to that little voice of what spirit is telling you. Okay. They want to take a leap of faith towards you. That's where spirit's telling them. But will they be able, yeah, they want to get to you. Six of swords and immediately, yeah, because they're feeling a lack. Knight of Cups, they want to balance out injustice, okay? Because they don't feel like they can move forward without their Two of Cups and marry you and get in, like you're everything to this person. Spirit, if Gemini gets back with this energy, what is going on? What is going on? This person needs to, to slow down a little bit. They're doing too much, okay? What else, Spirit? What's going on with this energy? What should, what's the obstacle of the energy? They could be already in a marriage, but they're coming off like they're single. Like I said, they're going to come off like they're single or they could be leaving this. I don't know, but if there's a marriage family unit that's preventing this person from coming forward because they have soul ties with this, the family, whoever they sleeping with, that's the, that's the obstacle. Wow. What is the, what's wrong with the family member? Whoever the, what's the wrong with the obstacle? What's the obstacles problem? What's the obstacles issue issue spirit? What's the obstacles issue? What's this mother, auntie, or whoever this family member is? Uh, it could be an uncle or a brother. Shit, I don't. Control. Their obstacle is they are the father. They could be somebody's father figure. It could be their damn daddy, child. It could be their religious beliefs. That's so far ingrained and embedded in them. Yeah. And they're all emotional about it. So there's a family member. It could be a masculine family member. I'm not trying to get extra, extra, extra. But there's a... Now, the mother... Well, hold on. Let me take something out the oven, y'all, real quick. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Hold on. Oh, I can't... Can I... Oh, this one, I can't pause it. Hold on. I'm going to run out and run in. Take that long. Hurry up, hurry up, Hethel. I'm hurrying up. Okay. Oh, sorry, guys. Okay. Oof. So, the obstacle is the father figure. And they're preventing this person. Who? Why is the emperor here? Who is the emperor spirit? The obstacle is the emperor, father figure, mother. What is going on? What's the obstacle? Who is the emperor, Holy Spirit? Or the emperor could be this traveling person that wants to come and travel towards you. Is he the obstacle or what's the emperor? Now, the emperor could be the mother figure too. She's just in her masculine energy because the mother is down here or the baby mama is down here causing all this ruckus and she's very toxic, like very controlling, narcissistic mother, narcissistic father energy, um, wanting control, okay? 
Their obstacle is walking away. They feel that they've invested too much in this mother figure or this father figure. Shit, I don't know how this is going. Yeah, they're too mentally brainwashed or warped or mentally unbalanced. You know, they are their own obstacle for moving forward. They're too flighty. They're too noncommittal. They're too all over the place, okay? What else, spirit? So, mm, what's the hangman? What's, what's, so, why are we knowing any of this? Jeez, I almost forgot what this thing was about. Because somebody's under judgment. That's getting ready. So, somebody... Spirit saying, watch out, whatever, whoever's coming towards you for forgiveness or an apology or whatever to make some type of offer because they're under judgment or they want some forgiveness. It's nothing but smoking mirrors and an illusion. Watch out because it's going to cause a tower. Okay, because whatever this is, is built on a faulty foundation and it's going to cause you a heavy ass burden. Okay, yeah, um, if you get in this relationship. Okay, what's the tower, Holy Spirit? What's the tower? What's this tower? The tower is like... Mm. Yeah, there's not going to be any movement. It's going to be the same thing over and over again because this narcissistic mother has her claws in this energy or the auntie or the cousin or the daddy or whoever. Okay, somebody got control and hold over this person. What is this, Spirit? Yeah, for them moving forward. Yeah, this if they try to walk away from you, when they try to walk away from you, move this person, like they're too, I don't know how to call it, one of those family members that just got a lot of mental control over this person, okay? Because plus they've been doing a lot of sex magic with this energy, got them all confused and everything, all in their head, don't know which way they need to go, feeling backstabbed and betrayed and stuff like that. This person is literally, they need a lot... They need some years of therapy, honestly, okay? Because they have been, I don't know what the heck had happened, y'all. Wow. I feel sad for this energy, though, but I mean, I only feel sad because I feel their pain, but they need to work that out. Like everybody, I mean, we all have, you know, help. We all need somebody to lean on, but this is not the lean on. Spirit saying, leave their ass out in the cold, please, okay? Um, yeah, because you can't do anything for this person. Spirit wants you to move on with your life, okay? Move on with your life, and you continue to heal because this person still needs to balance out their life. There's no need to get with an individual that is not balanced. So Spirit said, please protect and guard and block this energy and continue to move forward and heal in your own journey, okay? You have to move. So what's the outcome for this other energy, Spirit? This uh, masculine energy that's stuck and, you know, wants to come back to Gemini for healing. But he's got a lot of lustful things going on in the family. The outcome, yeah, he's going to walk away one day and lay it to rest with this family situation. Okay, and walk, walking away, and what's, it, what's that spirit? What's that? Yeah, honey, he's going to walk away. This man, mm-hmm. He's going to do the go in and, and heal too. It's going to take him a long time though, okay? Because this is not an overnight process. And like they say, because there's, they got blockages still that they need to work through. You don't want to intervene in those blockages to block you from moving forward. You know, let this person heal and deal on their own um, without you intervening in their healing process. Just like you're in hermit mode and certain things and you had to have the spirit actually lead and guide you. The same thing with this individual. We all think that we can step in and help and we can do this and I can blah, blah, blah. That's not true. Okay? You have to have the Holy Spirit do the work and the work through this person. Because God needs to make, um, this, they, they need to have a testimony. Okay? By you intervening is going to intervene in God's testimony. Okay? So, yeah. And this person is going through the dark night of his soul as well, trying to figure it out. So anyway, Gemini, that's been your reading. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to damper on this reading or whatever the case may be, but somebody in this energy needs to hear this and therefore it is what it is. And I love you so much and have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.